the Apollo 14 landing, moonwalk and liftoff. Now, I can't believe I've not seen this video before. I mean, to be fair, it's only recently been uploaded to YouTube. I'm a massive, massive space nerd. I love space. And it still kind of surprises me that people are skeptical about the actual moon landing. Some people believe that it didn't actually happen. Any, any of you who don't believe it happened, I'd love to know why. Like, why do you think it's it was faked? Um, how do you think they faked it? Like, because I personally think it happened. I, I think for it to have been a complete, you know, faked mission, something would have leaked by now. Like, it's been such a long time. So many people were involved. We would have had some actual evidence by now. I'm starting the camera. Can you imagine standing on the moon? Like just standing on something that isn't Earth, you know? Okay, okay. Houston, I'm on half. Roger it. Okay, 2,000. Unclick a little fast. Unclick a little 2,050 feet a second, a little bit fast, but not bad. Okay. I was scanning. Okay, I'm Craters and everything. Okay, the best spot is uh, a little south of track, about halfway between Triplet and Dublin. A little south of track. I'd be covered okay. in goosebumps. About 60 meters. Okay, it looks good from here. Looks good from here. Okay, I'll get through 550 feet. Okay. 16 feet per second, 500 feet, 15 feet per second. It looks good. Your fuel is good at 10%. So they're moving at 550 feet per second. Okay, let's right take now. it over and move okay. up. Okay, yeah, I think so. You're through 300. Okay. 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 I give you, give it a few clicks. You're through 200 feet. Per no, feet per second. That looks good. Hold that over here. It doesn't even and look like they're moving that quickly. Great. Okay, it looks like you're going right over the middle of uh, triplet. What's this here? Is this like a massive crater? Okay, you're still at 170 feet indicated. Starting down. Okay, you can move on forward. You're just barely crossing North Trippet. Barely crossing North Trippet. 6% fuel, okay. 150 feet. There's deep in quantity light. Okay. Low level. Alright. If you could land over here. There's some dust, Al. 110 feet. 3 feet per second there. 110 feet from surface. 6%. There's good dust. Go on your own. It's starting now. Starting now. Okay. It says 90 feet. 4 feet per second. 5 feet per second down. Okay. Down. Looking great. 60 seconds. Oh my okay, God. Okay, 50 feet down. The anticipation. We're in good shape, too. 
three feet per second, 40 feet, three feet per second, 30, three feet per second, looking great, 20 feet, 10, three Boom. feet per second, contact now, and stop. Wow. on the moon. Pro. Auto, auto. We're on the surface. Okay, we made a good landing. Because if they faked it, like they, everybody saw the rocket go up. Nobody saw the rocket come down. Like, so how would they have faked that? Like, you know, because there was a launch, which people saw that went up into the sky and that rocket did not explode and it didn't come back down. So unless they think the rocket is still like in orbit somewhere. I mean, I just, how do you argue with that? Like, I'm trying to. Four thirteen plus ten thousand. That was a beautiful one. And yeah, we're slightly off. We might have a slope, but other than that, we're in great shape. Yep. Right on the landing site. Okay, give me a mark, y'all, when you start using film. I just started using film now. Roger, are you on twenty-four? Dude, this is insane. Well. They're, they're literally on the moon. Like, that is just, it's so crazy. Okay, let me close the head. But not too far. But I get the argument about, like, why we haven't been back. Like, with all the advancements we've made, why haven't we been back to the moon? You know? It's been like 60 years. Yeah, look at the way the flag is like. Does this bridge look okay? Roger, oh, yeah, that's a good sight. Like the gravity is clearly not what it is on Earth. Like right, look at the way the flag is just like standing up straight. Okay. Does it very easily? It does indeed. I mean, how would they fake that? You know. Yeah, you're going off camera to the right. I suppose with CGI, but they didn't even have CGI back then, did they? Okay, that's good. Goosebumps moment, like major, major goosebumps moment. I think moment. I'm still too close to you. Uh, Except for the red leg. Yeah. Like, do you think the moon was always like this, or at some point was it, you know, yeah, when you finish, you can a planet around, like ours? Okay, and which magazine are you using? How long does it take messages to go back and forth from the moon to Earth? It must take a while. Like... Cable. Thank you. Yes, man. Cable both. Got them both. Back up. Try it again.
I mean, the pride that you'd feel, you know, right now. Because so many things could have gone wrong. So many. What's the final exposure number? Give me a good orientation for the flight. Okay, Ed, if you just turn it broadside. Just turn it broadside of the TV camera with the uh, field to the TV camera right that is 180 out from that, it'd be better. Okay, there you go. It's just like so you quiet. Get, uh, two five on the mic. Like there's no city, there's no noise aside from them. Like it's just like there's nothing going on there. I'll be out. Okay, that's good on the flag. Okay, Houston. Fifteen. Okay, the abort stage is set. Gasm engine is armed. Six, five, four, Go. three. What are they launching two, back to Earth now? One. Go. Go. This will be yeah. 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 Wow. And lift off. Roger ignition. Back to Earth. How long were they there for? The over. over. Ten seconds. The guidance. Roger. The onboard guidance has now taken hey, over baby. control. It's good. Crazy. We confirm auto ignition. That's affirmative auto ignition. And they're now tilting over at an angle, speeding up very quickly now. I mean, this is like the ultimate story. Like, nothing beats this. Oh, yeah, I went to the moon. <laughs> Like, how can you be? Nothing you could say could beat that. Like, uh, here we go to cross cut four. Bike the ball. Very much good, Houston. Roger, you're looking good from down here, Al. Up on one minute. Oh. Two, one, mark one. Mark one. Man. I would love it if we could go back with modern day cameras, like 8K cameras. Could you imagine what the footage would look like in color and everything? I suppose this was in color because the flag. At this point, in effect, they're on their backs, aren't they? They're, not, they're no longer vertical or relative to the moon. This is when they really need okay. confidence in that computer. Yeah, because their lives are in the, in the computer. And we did hands. have that spurious abort signal during the landing phase, don't forget. Trajectory looks good, we're at 12,000 feet. They've been rising now for two minutes, another five and a bit to go. Okay, steering is good, things look good, Houston. It's quite a way. Copy Al and your go from down here. Going up at the rate of a mile a minute on average. A mile a minute. 1600, 16,000. It's crazy because it doesn't look anywhere near that fast, but a mile a minute is rapid. At 700 miles an hour. And from that standing start, they've got to get up to 40,000 miles an hour to go into orbit. Okay, Houston. Of course, the interesting thing is they can't Coming see what they're aiming at. I mean, to put your life in the hands of a computer, like a 1960s computer, <sighs> takes a lot of confidence. Two, one, mark it. Three minutes. Good. 
they stuff good. They just think the bags are green. I'm surprised we didn't see more craters. Are, are these craters here? Talking about the uh, pre uh, fuel pressures in their reac reaction control yeah, system, yeah, the little yeah, motors yeah, on the side yeah. of the lunar module, which they don't really need at this stage. And your go from the ground at three and a half. Everything's nominal. Hey, Bruce, let's here. Nominal really means fine, mm. I think, in this context. Yeah. Used to be called all systems go in the old days. It might yeah. be helpful just to say which direction they're going, taking off from the surface of the moon. Uh, as we look at it, they are in, in effect uh, making a right hand turn and uh, going around uh, the back. Yeah, it's hard to tell uh, where the, uh, like the orientation. Which is good. Bags are right together. Like, I feel like the camera's pointing behind them right The now. two guidance systems, that is the... Uh, Terry Houston, your go from the ground, looking good. The primary onboard guidance system and the abort okay. guidance system both agreeing with each other, which is always comforting. Both producing the same set of figures, which means that uh, there's no conflict. And Terry Houston, now we show all the sure, things act and this fin in good agreement. And Miss Finn is the uh, tr network of tracking that's stations that's on the Earth, which okay, also sure. agrees with what the computer says. I wonder how much this will cost in, you know, if you, like, adjust for inflation, like, how much of the GDP of the country went towards this mission? But it's my to go out of play, look at him. Hey, look at Unbelievable video. I just don't see how they would have faked this successfully without, you know, some groundbreaking evidence coming out by now. Like, there must have been hundreds, if not thousands of people involved in this. Like, are you telling me that by now something, like, wouldn't have come out, like, somebody who worked in production? Like, let's say, let's say it was a Hollywood studio that did all of this. Are you telling me with the amount of money that would have been thrown at these people somebody wouldn't have anonymously leaked it to the media for sure it would have leaked i don't think it was faked i i don't believe it but if you do think it was faked let me know in the comments why genuinely want to hear what you have to say thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one